This is a quick demonstration of exporting video, both 3D and standard, as well as uh, how to turn presenter mode on and off inside of Twinmotion 2020. And this comes from a question I had on LinkedIn. In Twinmotion 2020, I'm going to go to the media dock and then select video. And you can see in here, I already have four videos. To make a new video, I'll click the create video button, add some keyframes here by just clicking the plus button. And on this last keyframe, I'm going to go ahead and use the camera here and move to a different spot and then hit the little refresh button on top of this keyframe. Now you can see we've got a video here with three different keyframes. Now from here, I'm going to go to the export dock and then click on the video link here. And I need to select all the videos that I want to use. I can click on each one that I want to export. I can click on a video again to unselect it, or I can select all the videos using the select all button. From here to change the video to 3D, I'm going to go to more and then use the mode button here. And I can go from standard to 360 video or video 360 3D. So that would be stereoscopic. From here, if we want to mess around with the presenter mode, we're going to go to the media dock again, select presenter, and click the create presenter button here. From here, we'll click on the new presenter that we just created, and then we'll click on where it says click here to add media. And then we just need to select the different videos or images by dragging them into the dock below. So we could also add images here, you can see, but I don't currently have any. So now that we have those added, we'll go back to export, and we can turn presenter mode on or off, and then we can go ahead and export. When we export, we're going to export everything that we currently have enabled. And whatever we have enabled will be in this export folder here. So images, videos, and presenter mode. In presenter mode, we're going to make sure that we give our clients the entire presenter mode folder. And inside that folder, there's an executable file that they can double click to launch. They won't need to install anything. Simply double clicking that file will launch the presenter mode. 